Broadcasting from the business capital of the world, this is the Podcast Business News Network. And we're so excited to be back here with Lavender Lane's Christine Goss talking today, well, about energy healing and all that she can do to help us, especially during uh, this Mother's Day weekend, which is coming upon us very quickly. But really, they're Integrated Healthcare and Holistic Wellness Center uh, based out of Waterloo, Ontario. So welcome back to the show today. How are you? Thanks so much, Jill. I'm great. Um, yeah, we're heading into Mother's Day and, you know, there can be good and bad in every relationship, right? And uh, we all have energies that need to be cleared. Um, and we are offering Mother's Day gift certificates. You can buy gift certificates all year round, but this is a lovely way to help your family member, you know, enjoy personal self-care. So we have in-person services, which include physio, osteopath, uh, massage therapy, chiropractic, and acupuncture. Um, and then we can deliver all of our holistic services online through our Jane app. It's a secure video call. It's one click and super easy to join. Um, and that includes Reiki, chakra balancing, emotional freedom technique, and life coaching. Um, and Ohana generational healing, intuitive card readings, intuitive channeling sessions, which, which can really help, you know, help with healing. Person and your personal growth, and really, and really moving you forward in your life, clearing out everything that doesn't serve us. Got it. And last week was amazing. She actually showed us how she worked every single chakra in the body. And for those of you on the podcast, we're also live on Zoom and vice versa. Um, and so she's got the table still set up to this week uh, to go over that. But I just want to bring up quickly last week, you did an energy clearing, cleansing not sure the terminology here, balancing, kind of both yeah. chakra balancing, see, balancing, clearing uh, <laughs> on me. I told you I have some really bad, severe earaches lately for like the past few months. Well, I didn't feel it till two days ago, but it went away. Yes. I have an inner ear pain that the doctors keep saying, now it's maybe it's TMJ, got to see the ENT specialist and it all started from an infection, but there's no fluid there. And you, you sent me energy last week and I'm feeling that that really helped me. Um, and so it, it, two days ago, it felt it a little bit, but not as strong, not as strong. So I, I, I want to thank you for that. And I'm hoping oh, I'm on welcome. the mend. So could you explain what you did just, you know, briefly t- to our uh, listeners? Sure. And I'm going to teach you guys how to do it to yourself. Awesome. Um, it won't, it won't be quite the same because, but, um, what I'm going to do is intend that every time you, you do it for yourself, that I'm sending Reiki to it. Um, So then it it ups it about a thousand percent in power. So um, what we did, and if you don't mind, I'll just do a quick recheck of your chakras. Sure. So we started out just looking, using a pendulum and I've got the the energy body represented with crystals here on my bed. Okay. So the ground is a little bit big again. Same with root. Root is red. Sacral is also a bit big, which would, and sacral and solar plexus were the ones that were really out of whack last time, but they're way better than they were last week, Jill. Wow. That's awesome. So Reiki energy and, you know, healing energy will last about three weeks. Okay. And then it needs to be replenished. Heart chakra is much better because last week it was about almost a foot across <laughs> in size and they're supposed to be, you know, a couple inches. Um, your throat chakra is better. Third eye. Nice. Okay. So they're all a little bit big, but way better balanced than last week. Okay. Wow. So that's amazing. And we're in a big energy shift right now because we just had the new moon and partial solar eclipse on April 30th. And that brings in, you know, new energy, you know, new beginnings, and we have to shed everything that doesn't serve us in order to make really big, radical transformation in our lives. Okay. Eclipses are all about change, and sometimes it can be very <laughs> jarring. Wow. Wow. Um, okay. So I'm finding quite a few people are struggling this week. Um, so what I'm going to have you do is we'll just run through a quick chakra little clearing exercise that you can do okay Okay, sure and i'm going to intend that white light is coming down through your crown and then you're going to move it through each chakra okay 
Um, and I'm going to balance you at the same time, so it's a two for one. And we'll, we'll make sure that we do this quickly this time. <laughs> Thank you. Um, so we'll start at the ground. You're going to bring in white light in through your crown. It's going to fill your body, and it's going to go to the, the ground chakra, which is four feet below your feet. And this chakra is about grounding, connecting, and balance. We need the Earth's energy for our health. Mm. The next is the root chakra. And it's basically where you're sitting right now, your saddle area. Okay. Um, so between your pubic bone and your tailbone. Now, the color here is red. And the root chakra is all about money, security, family, uh, significant male relationships, male reproductive issues, um, skin, and really is about safety and our right to exist in this world. Okay. So envision the white light there, making mm -hmm. that red, picture a red crystal there. Like okay. a ruby, it's just glowing. And you can take as long as you want with this process. Um, you can use it as a meditation, but I personally, I do it every day in the shower <laughs> Okay. And it, and it doesn't have to be take very long. Um, but cleansing your, cleansing your energy body of everything that doesn't serve you on a regular basis is super important to keep you healthy, um, and keep your stress down. Now we're at the sacral and that's where at your belly button and okay. that's female reproduction, digestive issues, uh, Big connections to mom here and significant females, um, which this weekend can, coming up can be difficult, especially if people have lost their mom. Mm -hmm. um, and how to deal with your emotions. Are you going to deal? How are you going to deal with them? Are you going to deal with them? Please don't bury them in your body. <laughs> okay. Get your creati creativity is here. Mm -hmm. The next one is your solar plexus. It's just below your rib cage. And okay. it's yellow like the sun. It's our power center. So this is where we, we get our gut feelings. And if we don't follow them, <laughs> usually it means we're going to get ourselves into trouble. Yeah. Um, we really should make, be making decisions with our heart chakra and our solar plexus chakra. Okay. So just watch that. Envision that crystal, that yellow crystal there shining like the sun. The next one is your heart chakra. This is about love, relationships, peace, healing, um, manifestation, heart health, of course, lungs. Um, so we really want to take good care of this chakra. We need to take care of ourselves first. Yep. The color yeah. here is green, which is the color of healing. And then we can also use rose, like a rosy pink care for self-love. We want that one bright and shiny. Okay. Okay. The next one is your throat chakra. And the color here is light blue. So you want to bring that white light in and clear it out. This is where we speak our truth. So in our solar plexus, we know it. But if we don't speak it, we can actually create a lot of issues with thyroid. Um, healthy boundaries is a big thing here. So, you know, being assertive and going, okay, you have crossed, <laughs> crossed the line, buddy. Um, and letting people know that that isn't acceptable. Okay. And, you know, there's a lot of people who have a big difficulty saying no. And sometimes mm -hmm. saying no to something you really don't want to do is the greatest act of self-love you can do. Okay. Now, the next one is your ear chakras. So when you're, you're doing this, you can actually pull the negative energy out of your ears. Okay. okay. We did that last week. Yeah. Yes. We'll do that again because that works so well. I'm so happy. Me too. We had Thank time you. Last week and I'm like, but I just finished the session and we got you pretty much back to balance. So I was really happy with that. Really? <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. It's my pleasure. Okay, so the next chakra is your third eye. It's in between your eyebrows. 
and it's all about your intuition. It's how we see our truth, our vision, like envisioning our future, looking at goals, um, and people's clairvoyance can come through this chakra. Mm-hmm. So we want it to be a beautiful, lovely purple, like amethyst. Okay. Okay. And want to make that glow we want it to be nice and bright and shiny and uh, we don't want it to be overactive because that will make us anxious and it can lead to you know overthinking yep. and being able to sleep and all sorts of disturbances there all right so just stir in some white light into that so anybody listening to this later you're going to get the energy because energy is independent of time and space. So um, you can be watching this months down the line and mm-hmm. still receive the healing, which is fabulous. So we're taking all the negative energy out of the chakras, sinking it into Mother Earth. She's going to transmute it to love and light. And then we're stirring white light. And now we're working on your crown. I like to put clear quartz here so it's white. Okay. When you shine white light down through a prism, it becomes the rainbow, which then becomes all your chakra colors, right? Yeah. Um, So our crown is where we connect to source, God, creator, universe, goddess, whatever you want to call it, whatever you resonate with. Um, The the powers that be, that greater force, May the force be with you. I got it. That's right. <laughs> Today is. I was just thinking about, about that. About that. Reiki, yeah. I was just thinking about that because, like, Reiki is so much like the force. It's it's all it binds everything that is alive in this world as and brings it together. It keeps our cells together. It makes our organ systems work. Like mm-hmm. it's just, it is so incredible to work That's with, and it's such <laughs> such profound healing, right? Yeah. We want that glowing. Okay, so take a nice deep breath in and just envision that white light sweeping your whole energy body clean. Okay, mm-hmm. and I'm just going to sweep your aura. This is just an extra step that I do for you guys. Mm-hmm. So we sweep it for mind, body, spirit, so everything is smooth again. Mm. Um, and then we just reground and close out that session. So it doesn't take very long okay. to use these techniques to just, and you can you can get to the point where you can ask your angels and guides to just, hey, can you clear me, please? <laughs> Especially if you've had an interaction with somebody that yep. didn't feel good. Um, you brought on you've taken on their energy so you want to clear that out immediately if you're working on the computer a lot or tech with technology it's good to, to do this regularly i'm just going to recheck your chakras Ooh, that's perfect oh this is lovely so just that little tiny bit of energy work your chakras are all balanced again Oh, I thought you said, oh, this is not good. <laughs> I was like, wait, no, what? they are all good. Okay, amazing, okay. Actually. Wonderful. Okay. Wow. So it doesn't take much to top up our bucket and really take care of ourselves. And being centered between heaven and earth, having a good, clear energy flow happening through your yep. chakra system is going to keep your body, your mind, your spirit, your soul so much happier so much healthier and then we can fight off things that are in the environment like viruses and (laughs) you know chronic disease we can we can actually treat and avoid all these things and we could do this ourselves. you're saying yes yeah so all you have to do is envision that white light coming through going right down into the ground sweeping everything that doesn't serve us into the ground thank you mother earth for changing that to love and light Mm -hmm. and then just use that white light use your breath to light up every energy center so you're looking at ground root sacral shoulder solar plexus heart throat third eye and crown so it's eight little eight little centers it doesn't take long and for you you need to work on your ear chakras yeah 
to clear out that negative energy that is irritating your ear. Which has done wonders. If you're just tuning in now, Christine worked on me last week, and I'm telling you, for five days, I felt no pain in my ears, and it came back a little bit the other day. That was it. It's not That's as, and so awesome. I'm hoping. No, really, I'm a believer. I'm a witness. <laughs> I, I'm, I, uh, I'm a com- I'm confirmed. It's what's the word? Um, You're a believer. <laughs> I'm a believer. Yeah, but I'm also yes, yes. <laughs> It, it makes energy work makes such a difference and it works so well with healthcare. Mm-hmm. Um, so we combine our energy work with healthcare here. So our physio, chiropractic, acupuncture, and osteopathy, they also use our practitioners and we work as a multidimensional team um, mm-hmm. because often pain in the body is not really from what's going on in the body. It mm-hmm. can be from, emotions that are pent up. It can be from past trauma, um, negative experiences that we've gone through. So all these things need to be cleared so that our immune system is strong. We're not stressed out because stress reduces your immune function. And when our immune system is not working properly, then we're going to have more problems with heart disease and diabetes and all these chronic issues that crop up. Even cancer is actually an immune disorder. So we can use these things to help. And when there is a disease process going on, we can use it to make the medical treatment that you're, that you are receiving even more effective and have less side effects. It's just incredible. Wow. Love it. Love it. Love it. Uh, Website, how we get in touch with you before we continue. Yes. Please go to lavenderlaneptw.ca. Go through and look at all of our practitioners. We all have had different experiences and use different modalities, uh, which we all use on ourselves. Um, figure out what, with your heart, what feels good. What, yeah. what does that does that fit with me? And then click on the person's picture. It takes them right into the schedule. You can book online. Perfect. And what else did you want to share with us today? Uh, we still have plenty of time in the show. Sure. Uh, so we've had oh. Two weeks ago, we had our, we were able to go to our first wellness fair and it's just, it was an actual in-person event. Um, we got to go out into the community and, you know, do our services and sell our products and see people, talk to people. It was actually really, really heart, <laughs> heartwarming mm-hmm. and wonderful. Um, so those kinds of things are starting to pop up again now that, you know, you know, COVID-19 is still around and, we have to manage it, but um, we're trying to get back to, to some normalcy, right? I know we really are. <laughs> <laughs> it's like fingers crossed. Um, and then on May 14th, we are holding an in person uh, spring into health event. And I was really humbled because it sold out in three days. <laughs> wow. So we're doing mini sessions. I'm doing chakra balancing. Lynn will be doing intuitive card readings and Vanessa will be doing acupressure massage, um, which is out of this world. Wow. Um, so we're definitely going to have to look at doing these more regularly because there's clearly a need. Um, everybody after the pandemic has been so overwhelmed and, you know, really struggling on every aspect, physical, mental, and emotional. And uh, we want to be there to help move you ahead, move you forward, get you on, on a different path. Um, Cause a lot of people have had, had time to really go, huh? I don't know if I want, if I like the direction of my life, <laughs> but, <laughs> right? let's start to work on, on, yeah. you know, what profession do I want to be in? What do I, how do I want to interact with people? What people need to exit my life for me to be healthy? Um, and how do I take care of myself? Because we have to take care of ourselves and have a full bucket, a full heart in order to help others Mm -hmm. without exhausting ourselves. So true. Right. And as a single mom, um, (laughs) it's a struggle, right? Mm -hmm. So that's why I do self-care for myself every day. I do Reiki on myself every day. I'm constantly, you know, every time I'm working with clients, I'm grounding and shielding and uh, doing that throughout the day to try to keep my energy clear. Um, and I go for massage and acupuncture and chiropractic once a month in order to maintain myself so that I can be the best mom and the best parent and, um, 
you know, the best physio Reiki master I can be. So it can be there for everybody. Because that, that's what fills my heart. <laughs> that fills up your cup. Yes, it does. Yeah. So for this session, um, anybody who's listening, you're going to receive Reiki from me, or actually I should say through me, because I'm a channel for Reiki. Mm -hmm. um, so it does not deplete my energy. So don't worry about that. That's the cool thing about Reiki is when, when anybody's using it, I get a session as well. Ah, so really? I never really, knew that. It works. It's a, it's, <laughs> it's a two for one deal. So okay. by, by being the channel, I get replenished as well. Wow. So that's what, that's one of the reasons why I love this modality so much. Clearly. It All right, great. Bucket as we do, as, as I treat and as I teach. <sighs> All right. Mm -hmm. continue to fill the bucket. Let's go. Yes. I'm loving this because I feel like I'm on a roll. I feel so much better than last week. Yay. Really? That's amazing. It is. That's <laughs> awesome. And, you know, with repeated sessions, you start to see big changes happening in your body, in your life. Um, it's it, it. Reiki has profoundly changed my life. Like I wouldn't be here sitting here in my clinic without it. I don't know where I'd be. I know, it's actually kind of a scary thing to think about. <laughs> <laughs> but please go to our website, check out all of our services. We're, we're always having events. Um, I'm trying to organize a in-person Reiki class on May 28th and 29th. I only take four people and it's in person. We're only two hours north of Buffalo. Yeah. <laughs> so we're really not that far away. Nope. Um, and um, the more people we can help, the better we serve our purpose. And that just fills our bucket even further. We love it. We love it. We love it. And uh, again, all these sessions are done uh, virtually, could be done in person. Um, yes. And anything you're feeling, you know, with Mother's Day uh, in store for the weekend, and it's a great gift to give someone, a mom who especially needs this type of work. Moms, hello, we're the ones who are stressed and anxious. So for Mother's Day, do you offer gift certificates uh, for everyone? Yes, we have, we have gift, gift certificates available throughout the year. So if you contact me through the website, we can have a chat about what your mom needs and uh, try to figure out who is the best fit. Um, we can start out with Reiki and or a chakra balancing technique, for example. Um, you can add Ohana generational healing if there's past traumas from previous generations. Um, intuitive card reading, which is super fun. Um, Intuitive channeling and intuitive card reading really give you a, a picture of where you're at and where you need to go. What are the next steps to help you grow? Yeah. Um, it's, it's something I use all the time. So they're really fun sessions. Um, yeah, we get into some serious topics sometimes, but um, everyone leaves feeling renewed, refreshed, and like they've released things. They feel lighter. And it's just a beautiful thing to see. Good. Well, thank you so much. And one more time, the website and contact number. LavenderLanePTW.ca is the website. We're on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. And you can call us at 519-804-3332. And we'll design something that's individual for your person. Perfect. Thank you so much, Christine. And you, uh, really, really appreciate your help in this energy clearing and chakra balancing session. And I'm hoping to have better news next week to feel even better than I did this week. So excellent. I'm really. so excited. Thank you. I, I <laughs> really, I really am. <laughs> I'm reaping the benefits, but you at home can as well. And just curious, what other services do you offer? We still got two minutes left. I don't want you to, you know, sure. lose your time. So what else did you want to share? Sure. Um, for in-person services, Joshua Webster is our acupuncturist. Um, if if you're local, um, you could talk. You could think about doing some sessions for mom if she's feeling like I'm having an issue with my mom because like she's like, oh, I need some work done and <laughs> yeah. I want my eyes done and my you know things lifted. And I'm like, wow, mom, that's pretty radical. But Josh does cosmetic acupuncture. And you can put it through your acup acupuncture benefits. And what it does is it tones up the muscles of the face and instantly lifts, lightens, and takes some of the fluid out of there so it doesn't look so puffy. 
Mm -hmm. um, and uh, helps to rejuvenate the face, bring better energy, and that healthy glow. Good. Well, thank you. So there's you lots so of much. different ways that we can look at things. Got it. Well, thank you so much for sharing this, for being here at Lavender Lane again. Christine Goss, we appreciate you. And uh, thank you again. Please reach out to her. Great idea for Mother's Day gift certificates. And looking forward to speaking with you again. Stay tuned. Are you looking for even more of the podcasts and hosts that you love? The Podcast Business News Network is proud to announce that you now have even more ways to listen live. Check out the MyTuner Radio, Online Radio Box, and Simple Radio apps on iOS and Android, or find us online. Search for Business News Network on mytuner-radio.com or search Podcast Business News Network on streama.com and onlineradiobox.com slash US. Take your podcast on the go and don't miss a minute of the action. Broadcasting from the business capital of the world, this is the Podcast Business News Network. For nearly 2,000 severely injured veterans, everyday life has become filled with barriers. Day-to-day -day simple tasks can become pretty daunting. I have to carry my chair up two flights of steps or have somebody do it for me. What scares me the most is just the falling. When I'm struggling with my house, I think, you know, to have that one great barrier just knocked down, I mean, it's, it's crucial. Home for Our Troops is a wonderful nonprofit that builds a mortgage-free, fully adaptive, handicap-accessible house, and there's no catch. It'll be our very first home that we've ever owned. This is a game changer. This is where your life begins again. We need you to join us in completing this important mission. Please visit hfotusa.org and help build homes and rebuild lives. Because of you, everything's going to be okay.